Well, in less than an hour, someone somewhere in America <laughs> could be $830 million richer. That's if they win the Mega Millions jackpot. And it is the third largest Mega Millions prize in the game's 20-year history. WGN's Shannon Halligan is in Roscoe Village where people lined up for their chance. Hey, Shannon. Crazy, oh, two of them. Thing the whole day. All day, all day, all day. Just mega, mega, mega. Someone has to win. <laughs> At $830 million, it's the third largest Mega Millions jackpot ever. People lined up at the Sarah Mart on Addison to try their odds. Kara McPherson bought her first lottery ticket ever. I just was like, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't even know where they sell lottery tickets. We're joining into the fun. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. yeah, might as well. Yeah, well, you never know, right? <laughs> That's right. You can't win if you don't buy one. The last time someone won the Mega Millions was in April. The jackpot has been growing ever since. The cash value comes out to nearly $488 million. That's if only one person has all the right numbers. But the odds of picking the winning combination, about one in 303 million, which is why some say they don't even bother. No, it's not in the odds. I'll invest it somewhere else, I guess, so. <laughs> And there have been 28 drawings since the last winner back in April. Be sure to tune in to WGN News at 10 tonight for those winning numbers. And then if no one wins tonight, the near record jackpot will only grow. Live in Roscoe Village, Shannon Halligan, WGN News. We'll take a pack of gum before you leave. Thanks, <laughs> Shannon.